Good morning. It doesn't look it. <laughs> it doesn't look it. The weather here in the UK, rubbish. Rubbish. How we doing guys, all right? How the bididly are we? I don't think I've done a vlog since last week. I'm slipping. I definitely haven't done a vlog since last week. Muddy, muddy mash. Yeah, I've got no content this morning. I don't know what to talk about. How are we doing? Hope you've had a good weekend. Most of the vlogs do actually run at least a week behind, if you hadn't probably noticed already. Um, if you follow me on Instagram or anything like that, then sometimes you'll see the pictures that I put up and you think, that's quite a nice picture, looks like it was a nice day. Well, that's not at the moment, is it? <laughs> there is a bit of a time lag, because obviously I don't get time to film it and then stick it up straight away. The videos you'll be watching today will have been made at least a week ago. So I do apologise about that. I may even be dead tomorrow. <gasps> So when you're watching this vid, no, because if I died tomorrow, I wouldn't have edited this one, would I? Because yeah. nobody knows. Nobody knows if we're going to be here tomorrow or not. Nobody knows. Sadly, my best friend wasn't around the day after. He died. He, didn't, he thought he was going to be around the next day. And sadly, he wasn't. He got up one morning, went off and did the things he loved, and wanted to enjoy what he wanted to do in his daytime. Unfortunately, he never made it till the following day. He had a big asthma attack, and unfortunately, he died. And he, did, he wasn't around for the following day. You never know, guys. You really should live every day, make the most of it, which I do try to do. I know I do get a bit grumpy sometimes, but then I guess we all do. I do struggle from day to day, but I do try my best. Especially on days like this, you have to try and work that little bit harder when the days are like this. Yes, it was my birthday over the weekend and I did nothing. I was very disappointed. I was really looking forward to having doing something on my birthday weekend. I did nothing. Rubbish. Trying to keep everybody else happy, you see. And you end up doing nothing yourself. Always the same, that is. Trying to keep everybody else pleased and happy. And, and you don't do nothing. It's good, isn't it? Well done, Ost. I was hoping to go away the weekend. Didn't happen. Didn't have the money anyway, so I couldn't afford to go anywhere anyway. Yes, birthday weekend. And I thought, yeah, let's all go away as a family. That's why I built the camper, didn't I? So we could all go away as a family. Funny enough, family don't like going in it. We didn't go anywhere. Well, I did. I went somewhere Saturday night. I just went on Clevedon Seafront. It was um, a few miles away, but it's summer, so I got one night. It's better than nothing, I guess. Basically, didn't do nothing else the rest of the weekend. <laughs> that was it. That was all I did. Never went anywhere. On Saturday, we did actually drive to. Um, we drove to Glastonbury to have a day out, which was nice. Had a subway, and then we got a phone call and realised we were supposed to be somewhere else. Let's drive all the way home again. <laughs> so that was a waste of time. So, yeah, that's about it, really. So I've had a, a fun-filled, not-doing-anything weekend. So I feel really glad to get out today. Definitely an outdoor person. I definitely couldn't sit in an office all day. Couldn't do that. I'd do my head in. Can't do, I can't be doing with that. I think maybe it's just don't get enough light or something. I don't know, but I just need to be outdoors. Can't be doing being stuck in at all. Yes, got a few bits and bobs to do today. No work again, as usual. I'm still looking into maybe doing some other things. I think the, uh, the bikes are just dead. It's absolute rubbish. There's nothing at all at the moment. I think I've had one phone call in three weeks. Absolute rubbish. I think the cycling industry is totally in decline. Unless you've got a big fat numpty shop, which sells loads of overpriced rubbish. Basically, unless you've got a numpty bike shop, seriously OTT bike shop, they're the ones that seem to just seem to do well. I think basically because the numpty's got plenty of money to spend. You know, you're buying all these fully titanium five and a half thousand and they keep it in their garages you know they want to go for a bike ride they, it's all about how much money they've spent on the bike you know they spend about three and a half grand or um hybrids you know the titanium carbon fiber bikes they never ride them they never ride them seriously because i get them in so i know i get them in for servicing sometimes and they they come up with this rubbish that they've done all these miles and i've done a triathlon and i'm doing this and i'm doing that and you look at the bloke and you know blatantly that they're talking a load of rubbish knowing out their teeth it's all fake and they don't ride them at all you can look at it and think that hasn't been ridden in six months and they're going on for super riders and all this rubbish and you know damn well they ain't so it's all about spending the money. They're the sort of bike shops that do well, you see. 
or seem to from my experience. Been in this trade for about 15 years now. You look at all the smaller bike shops, the like the bike shops that I would probably run if I had a shop, they're all closing down. You know, you've got the likes of Halfords doing their service contracts. You pay so many pounds a month. When your bike's broken, you take it into your local Halfords shop and then they fix it. You have that service contract. Yes, yeah, a bit mad really. But um, yeah, I suppose that's how it is, isn't it? Oh, yes. Yeah, the, I think it's like the cheap bikes they sell as well. And the service contracts. Maybe that's why I haven't got no work. Because everybody's having service contracts at Halfords. <laughs> Actually, it's probably because nobody's riding them because the weather's crap. That's probably why. <laughs> that probably makes more sense. Anyway, that too. Wow, 13 minutes. Do go on, Aust. Yeah, that's me. That's another waffle for the week. Hope you had a good weekend. Please leave your comments down below because I do like to have a read. And yes, I do read every single one. Ta-ta for now. Stay dry. Shook.